Oh, <laughs> well, hello there. Oh, no, 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 you're not interrupting. I was just enjoying the peace and quiet. It's been a pretty busy day at Starshine today. Come in, come in, have a seat. I could get you some hot cocoa. I think my mom's making a pot right now in the kitchen, actually. Hmm? Oh, this? Oh, <laughs> it's the Legend of the Hadron Stallion. You've never heard of the Hadron? Seriously? It's like the most important story in Jorvik's history. <laughs> yes, I'm serious. You've really never heard of it before. Well, <laughs> we're gonna fix that. Because this is the legend of the Hadrian Stallion. Long ago, when the frost enters Jorvik and the lakes freeze over, as snowflakes drift from the cloud, leaving a white blanket of swirling snow over the land, there roams a mysterious creature. Some believe it to be half horse, half goat. Some believe it to be a demon or a mistake. But those who truly know his story know him as a miracle. They say where the Hadron goes, the winter season follows. The stallion has a sleek gray coat with distinct markings lining its fur and horns that twist like a goat's. Those lucky enough to see him wandering the woods say he has piercing blue eyes that match the northern light's glow. His purpose? To protect and watch over those of Jorvik during the freezing months and to carry the northern lights across the sky, helping them dance across the night, bringing beauty to the land. However, greed causes people to do terrible things. There were those who wanted the Hadron's power for themselves, thinking they could control other things with it. So they hunted him. A vile man, a chief in search of the Hadron's power. The Fergrovian leader went out, chasing the Hadron down. He would not stop until the power was in his possession. But the mighty Hadron would not go down without a fight. He outran the chief, but it would not be enough as, in the end, he was cornered and taken back to Fergrove where he'd have his powers stripped from him and be given to the chief. With the Hadron away from his natural lands, the northern lights of Jorvik disappeared and the magic of Christmas had slowly drifted away, leaving the Hadron not only restless, but growing weaker by the minute. However, later in the evening, the chief's daughter, no older than eleven years of age, came to see the Hadron. She could sense his depression and restlessness, and see how he belonged out there, where he could watch over the winter and bring lights to the sky. Aware of the wrong that her father had done, she rescued the Hadron, and was the first and perhaps the only human to ever ride the magical stallion. Releasing him back to the snowy forest, the Hadron would be free and able to protect all of Jorvik for the rest of eternity. Though his story is widely known, only a few have been lucky enough to spot this magical creature roaming the woods. But every year, tourists go out in search of a photograph of this beauty, but they have yet to succeed. So, with winter coming and going every year, the legend of the Hadron Stallion carries on, with the elders telling it to their children and their children and so on. The Hadron has become a symbol and a promise in Jorvik. But it is just a legend after all. It's up to you to decide if you want to believe it. Uh, hello everyone. Uh, thank you for watching this video. I know it was way different than what I, you know, usually do versus my role plays. This is a bit more of like a fun, like legend-based type thing, interaction video. Uh, anyway, if you like it then be sure to leave a thumbs up and maybe i'll do something like this in the future i don't know i know this video was a little bit shorter uh and but i mean you know i posted a really long video last week so it kind of balances out <laughs> anyway uh i also wanted to really quickly mention that i've been working on a really really big project for like the past month definitely in the process of being finished and i am getting there i've still got a long ways to go but i really wanted to like let you guys know if you're still watching then I wanted to tell you to stick around and to be aware that I'm working on something very special. I can't really tell you anything about it just yet, but I will definitely alert you in the future. 
So you should definitely subscribe and keep an eye on my community tab so that you will always know when I post a new video and you can be the first to know about this secret project. Uh, otherwise, I think that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, sound up in the comments, and hit that subscribe button. If you made it this far into the video, then comment the word winter and I will go through and I'll read them and I try to respond to all my comments and I usually am able to do that, but if you made it this far into the video, then good job, you're special. Anyway, uh, I guess that's all I have to say, so uh, see you in the next video. Bye!